So this video is three stars from the 2013 single-headed nationals. I'm wearing a head cam so you can see exactly what I can see and you can see in this first start on the first day it's very light and you can see some of the young kids here. This is Noah who only weighs 75 pounds. There's all kinds of speed in the fleet. This first start is interesting because I have a really good start and I throw it all the way. See if you can pick the air. At this point, I'm not really sure what these boats are going to do. I'm going to try for a pin start because it's pin favored. Okay, so here's a mistake. Not the big one that I was referring to, but there's no one close to me, so there's no need for me to get this close to the mark. I look back here and see that everybody's got a good start. Right now things are looking pretty good. This is a brand new boat. It's the first time it's been in the water. It's really nicely made, but the traveler was set too loose you'll see that the block is too close to the center line. I had speed problems all day long trying to get the boom out and down. And you'll see in a moment, I'll try to actually let the sail out and pull it in again to see if it goes out. It will not go out. I've never sailed before at Spring Lake. And I have no idea which side is favored, but you can see that already some of the boats have tacked and they're going to the right side. Okay, so here's my big mistake. What was I thinking? Never sailed it before. Everybody's tacked to go right towards the shore, which turned out to be favored. And here I am on my own, have no clue which way I'm going, and I've just thrown away a good start. Needless to say, this was my worst race. So this next race, it's committee boat favored, and I'm going to show you how to position yourself. It's all about stopping, starting, and going sideways. I just lifted the board to check for weeds. Weeds were not a factor. So right now I'm pushing the boom to stop. It's like a break. I want to get below people. So I'm going backwards a bit. I'm going to start to duck people. I just think I'm too high at the moment. A little crowded. Want to get below people? No, change my mind. Slow down, push the boom. Let's just sit and wait for things to materialize. 90% of starting at this end is being patient.
people tend to set up a little too early at the boat, watch how they go sideways. And in doing so, they open up a nice little hole. Slow down a bit. Just wait. Be patient. I think it's going to work. Let's see what happens. Get my nose in there. Wait for the gun. Now if you look down below, look how much these bolts just slid sideways. This was a much better start, clear air, and the option to attack whenever I want to go right to the favorite side. You'll notice that my traveler is still way too high. And as a result, you can see that some of the juniors, the really good juniors, have got better speed and are pointing higher. With this third start, you'll see the wind has shifted and we're forced to start right beside the shore. We're jammed up against the shore. One minute to go. Again, it's committee boat favorite, so I'm going to try to start this time right beside the boat, but this one is a little different. It gets a little crowded. Just ahead of me is Jim, who's won this event many, many, many times. And I decide to put in the brakes. You've got to be careful here. This could be tricky. So here is decision time. It's looking crowded. Do I go below him? Do I go on top? Below doesn't look right. I think he's going to drift sideways, so I'm going to continue going. But this is a key moment right here. Jim's getting really crowded out here. I think he stalled out. Look at his rudder action. Going back and forth. He's going sideways. And it worked. You've got to be really careful on the starting line when you've got the only colored sail in the fleet. Especially when you're right beside the committee boat. So we're going to follow this sequence for about a minute. I know that the right side of the course is favored, people are attacking, so I go with them. But I made a small mistake here. I've attacked right on top of someone, which I don't want to do unless there's a tactical reason. Sorry about that. Didn't see You'll also notice that in this, the second day on the water, I've got the traveler lower and the boom further out. So it worked and I went on to win this race. So there you go, folks. Three different starts, three very different results.